two. What's up, baby? It's your boy DMD back with a video. Okay, the video that you seen yesterday, uh, well, I gotta explain it to you when I get home, but I'm hauling ass and it's a long story. It's a long story, but I got to drive in Sugarland, which is 20 minutes away from where I live because I got to get these shoes. And I vlogged it yesterday, but the plan didn't go as as I thought it was for the shoes that I thought I was going to get for steel, but it ended up I couldn't get them because Nike was tripping, whatever. I'm going to tell you the story in a little bit, but I'm hauling ass right now because I already called the store. I called City Gear, and they said they only have like two sizes left of the shoe that I want, so I'm hauling ass right now to make sure I get my size, so hopefully I can get the last pair, and uh, then I'm going to give y'all that review, and I'm going to explain to y'all the whole situation and all that good shit but right now i'm hauling ass driving on the opposite side of the goddamn town but hey man i want these shoes real 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 bad and hey man you gotta do what you gotta do sometimes so anyway uh let me put this camera up and let me uh, uh do some fast and furious houston edition all right so i'm in sugarland right sharp left to stay on town center boulevard north sharp left make a left oh shit I'm on the opposite side of the road, I'm about to die! Oh, no, 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 it's right here. <laughs> I'm tripping. All right, so yeah, I'm here. Uh, said make a left, go go straight, and then make a left. All right, uh, I haven't been in Sugarland in so, so long, man. All oh, this looks brand new to me, man. It's it's nice over here in Sugarland. But we are rolling up to the city gear, and hopefully they did not sell my shoe size. Move your ass, you taking too long. I got to jump in front of you. Fuck you, me. Right. I'm, I'm on the right. Okay, I see it over here. Ah, let me turn my GPS off because I got to use my battery to go work out. Uh, but here it go. Oh shit! I thought that was it. God damn, I'm, I'm stupid as fuck. Oh shit. Where the hell is this city gear? All right, uh, I'll be right back. I gotta go find this city gear. I thought that was it right there, but apparently that. Oh, it's right here, dumbass. <laughs> Hi, right, man. Woo! What a long, long day, man. Let me explain to you this whole situation because the video that I posted yesterday I said that I was going to get this shoe for the Lolo from my Nike plug but Nike they was trolling on the app and they wouldn't let him use his discount code on this shoe so when he was telling me yo it's not letting me use my discount I was like god damn and then by that time it was like seven eight o'clock and i'm calling around foot locker foot champs chic all these places hey do you have a size 11 and a half 12 no 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 everybody was damn near sold out and then i called one place and then they said try city gear so i called city gear they said that they had uh one size 11 and a half and one size 12 and i had to drive way to sugarland so i paid full retail for this shoe so I didn't care like I would have liked the discount because the discount would have been $124 instead of $200 but I ain't tripping I love this shoe regardless I was gonna get this shoe if I didn't get the discount or if I did but of course I would have preferred the discount but either way this is a shoe I could not pass man and yes sir we Bobby baby your boy got the vapor plus vapor max Flynet point two as you see look at the goddamn um tag right here boom shakalaka 11 and a half now i'm going to explain the sizing on these vapor maxes because it is truly truly difficult to like actually talk about this uh 190 is the price point look at the box you know all that good shit whatever 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 the case may be you know what i mean look at that open it up it has some uh, Vapor Max like prints on the shoe and all that stuff. But let's take the shoe out because that's what we that's what we really want to see. <laughs> Who gives a fuck about a box? But let me while I'm talking, I'm going to do an on foot video on the side over here somewhere so I can not uh, make this video too, too, too long. But let me talk about the sizing of this shoe, all right? Now, I'm a true to size 11. That's what the majority of my Jordans and my other shoes are. But like I said in my video yesterday, you want to 
go to the store and try these on because the fitting and the fit is very, very weird on this shoe. Let me get behind the camera while I'm talking about the uh, fitting so y'all can, oh, man, these hoes is clean, bro. Let me take out this goddamn shit. But these hoes is clean. But let me talk about the fitting of the shoe, all right? So I'm a size 11. Do not go true to size on this shoe. This is just my opinion and how it felt on my feet. Do not go true to size on this because it will be tight as fuck. Now, if you go a half size up like I did, this is a size 11 and a half. Wear this with no socks or a very thin layer of a sock, okay? Don't wear like your regular thick padding socks or like your backs backs of ball socks or your football socks or just anything that's like a thick cotton layer of socks if you if you wear socks which i highly don't recommend because i mean this is pretty much a sock in itself like this is a fly net i mean this this is a sock shoe you know what i mean but if you plan on wearing socks with this shoe i would say go a full size up so if I was to wear socks with this shoe, I would get a size 12 because I'm a size 11. But I don't plan on wearing any socks with this shoe. So I went with a size 11 and a half. And 11 and a half with no socks fits perfect. I'm talking about it fits perfect. It fits tailor-made. So if you go a half size up in these, go with no socks all right that's that's very important all right so once again don't go true to size to these in my opinion I, I'm, I'm just i'm just telling you how it felt on my feet do do not go true to size on this if you go a half size up don't wear any socks but if you want to wear you know like the thicker layer socks if you want more protection or i don't know if you just like wearing thick socks um, go a full size up, okay? So that's my recommendation on, on the sizing and all that shit. But other than that, man, this is a dope-ass shoe, man. And I had to get this colorway, dope colorway. So I got one pair of the first Vapor Air Max. Matter of fact, let me get that real quick. Hold on, hold on. I'll be, I'll be okay. It's over here. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. So this, this is the Vapor Air Max 1. The first version that came out, boom. I got that baby blue, light blue, water, I don't know, whatever. And this is the 2.0. So let's just look at the difference real quick. Compare, contrast. Now one big difference is, is the back. Like the back has this extra knitting. Now I'm not a technical guy, so I can't give you a technical difference, but just the visual look, we got Vapor Max on the writing on the first one, and we don't have that here. We got a pull tab on this one, and we don't on this one. And this also has just, you know, this extra shit right here, which I don't know what the fuck that is, but uh, this is the side view of them. Boom shakalaka, and here's the front. So, just to give you a little example, like on here, on, on the tongue, the tongue is different. It has like two different textures right here. And this one pretty much just has one big texture right here. And that's the other side. So, bow. So I do need to get the Vapor Max Plus. I am going to order one pair of the Vapor Max Plus so I can have at least one shoe of every single model. But other than that, man, this is a dope ass shoe. I'm definitely happy to add it to the collection. And I will be getting a Vapor Max Plus very, very soon um, off a of GOAT, really, because there's, there's one particular colorway that I need to get that I love, and it's damn near for retail. So y'all going to probably see that uh, coming up soon. But yeah, man, these is dope. Leave a comment down below. These are very comfortable and very lightweight at the same damn time, man. But anyway, I don't want to make this video too, too, too long. Dope as shoe. Definitely had this happy to add it to the collection man so leave a comment down below let me know if you cop these these are great working out shoes i don't know about running because i, I don't run I'm, I'm not a runner but this is like a dope casual shoe 
comfortable shoe. You go to the gym, you work out, and you do your damn thing. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, man, it's your boy DMD. I'm signing out. I'll see you on my next video. Comment, like, subscribe, baby. Peace.